Good morning to everybody. I have a fun project in store for today. This is a very special occasion. My friend Josh up in Boise, Idaho built a custom Hot Wheels display for me. It's behind me on the floor there. I'll show you a little bit about it right now. And then there's some final assembly steps needed before it's ready to hang up and uh, put the cars on it. Falls, this is Sushi Ya. This is the place worth driving 18 hours from Phoenix, Arizona for. And now is the grand finale of the trip where I get to unveil a special piece of art for my Acura showroom in Phoenix, Arizona. Josh, go. are you ready for the drum roll? Go ahead, do okay, it. Okay, here we go. It's oh, in a pillowcase. It's, it's wrapped up. All yep, right. it's in a pillowcase. You're making it difficult for me. <laughs> oh man, oh man, what is this? Josh, you have really, Pete might have to help me with this. Let's see, grab that pillowcase. What did you do here? Holy crap. Are you serious with this? You even nailed the font. How did you do that? Dude. This Hot Wheels display has actual emblems in it from an MDX and a Pilot that are sort of baked in or uh, enclosed in the glaze that's part of this. These letters are all hand cut, hand sanded, hand painted. Everything about this is completely one off. Now the track here, that's actually the layout of the Honda Performance Center HPC Proving Ground out in Southern California. But what's interesting is I'm actually gonna be covering that up. There are some slats that will go down here and then three rows of cars across. You'll see what I mean when it's finished, but I did ask Josh if he would be willing to sign this, so he did. It's noted here as one of one, and uh, the date there, 6-9, was the date that um, I got it. Here's the finished product. This thing is awesome. I obviously have room to grow here because I have not filled up all three rows, but I'm getting started. So this is just to compare. This is what I was showing my Hot Wheels with before, just a very simple and crudely built thing I found online. And this is way, way more appropriate for the showroom. So thank you, huge thank you to you, Josh, for this generous contribution. And I look forward to filling it up. A couple other smaller things I'll show you here. I added a little brochure stand here for the Legend accessories pamphlet and some other stuff like vintage maps and uh, SL <clears throat> SLX accessories. And a picture of the original Integra that started it all. That's my mom and her 1990 Integra GS 24 years ago in 1996. And uh-oh, access requested to the restricted area. If you ever come over here, I will grant you access. Thanks everybody for watching, tune in next time.